Welcome to my Yakuza Kiwami 100% Trophy Guide video. In this video we're going to cover substories, specifically chapter 6 substories. So we're going to cover three of the Kamaki uh, substories in chapter 6. Uh, basically I missed one as well, but we're going to cover the Shot Stopper, Swordsmanship, Roundhouse Attack is the one I missed, and then Catlight Reflexes. And then we're going to cover the battle for the Mezu King Throne as well to top it off for this chapter. So as always we're going to read from Xerxes guide. Please check out that guide, it's linked in the description. Really awesome guides for all the Yakuza's. Definitely worth your time. So yeah, without further ado, the Kamaki Shot Stopper. So when you enter Purgatory in Chapter 6, Kamaki will stop and ask if you would become a student. Agree and he'll teach you the first move. Follow the directions and use that move on the two guys he brings with him. The next one is swordsmanship. So Kamaki will request a wooden katana before doing this training, and you can buy this at a bizu pawn. Equip it and accept his challenge. Attack him with multiple types of strikes with the katana to complete this element of the training. So Kamaki roundhouse attack, which I missed. So earn the image of Ashura uh, from the Colosseum. So in in terms of the Colosseum, you have to beat. Uh, like rounds of the Colosseum and if you don't take any damage and you do certain finishes and stuff you get more points so you have to earn points to buy from the Colosseum shop all these uh, images and then that allows you to commence the next part of the training so present that to Kamaki he will gather a group of seven guys and you'll need to defeat them in three minutes after that you'll earn the roundhouse attack and will be asked to test it Simply use it to redirect attacks in the middle of your combo in other directions, which is pretty cool. And you've got the Kamaki cat-like reflexes. So earn the image of a cat from the Colosseum and present it to Kamaki. Beat the guy down, uh, beat the guy with the bat, and you'll earn the Kamaki cat feet, a way to regain your footing after falling. Practice it again on the same guy, and that's it. So you can keep doing the Kamaki ones in this uh, chapter, but I'd recommend you don't really need it. Like, and it takes a long time to grind out the Colosseum, so maybe do that in the next chapter or a bit further on.
Um, and the final one, sorry, is the Mezu King battle for the throne. So, you can do this in Chapter 5 technically, but uh, it has to be after uh, the final uh, Mezu King substory, and you have to have 50 cards. So, it's quite awkward to get 50 cards at that point, but you can try if you want. You can do this while on the way to the batting centre at the end of the chapter. But anyway, in chapter 6 we did it, so speak to the professor, ask to battle him seriously. If you defeat him, you'll get the Mezu King throne and the Hercules Beetle card, so... Pretty tough one that, I remember that being a difficult, uh, difficult round of cards, so... Yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And please check out Syrixie's guide in the description. Really good guides. Peace.